For 100 years, the YMCA of Central New Mexico has supported our local communities, focusing on diversity in people, cultures, and religions, working with our neighbors to empower people and communities in our great state of New Mexico. Joining us now to talk more about the YMCA of Central New Mexico and celebrating 100 years is President Zizi Fritz. Zizi, first of all, thank you for what YMC does for our thank community. Thank you for it just, having us, Chad. It really is immeasurable. So um, let's talk about turning 100. You guys have a lot of things going on to celebrate. Incredible. We started out with a uh, launch uh, for our founders mm -hmm. uh, that are still around, some of them and uh, moved into the Healthy Kids Day, which was on April 25th. Just uh, a whole bunch of activity that went on, mm -hmm. uh, getting kids ready for the summer, getting them uh, eating well, exercising, and so forth. And uh, we're getting ready for the Isotopes game on uh, July 27th. So we'll have okay. about 500 kids out of the game no uh, there uh, at, the, at the Isotopes Park. And then uh, we will have a run, a 10K, 5K, 1K, uh, the Bosky Boogie, which we, we all know on October 4th should be great. That's mm -hmm. just one of the nicest venues in the United States for, I, I believe, for a beautiful, beautiful run. Oh, absolutely. So we want, uh, we want families and everybody coming out that day. That's great. And um, so we've got all kinds of programs going on. Yeah, let's on. talk a little yes. bit about some of the programs. We've got, uh, of course, our summer camps are up and running, and uh, they are doing everything from art attacks to um, uh, STEM on steroids, which is uh, a uh, locomotive that's being refurbished here in downtown uh, no Albuquerque. No kidding. Wow. And the okay. kids are out uh, checking that out. They've uh -huh. got field trips, and, of course, we always... Uh, uh, we always introduce learning, but it's always very fun. So mm -hmm. from baseball, math to yeah. you name it, they're out and, that's, and they're... I, that's one of the great things is that you get the kids active, but you are teaching them all along the way. Are, yeah. uh, let's talk about this. Um, uh, camp Shaver, what is that? An incredible, incredible, beautiful camp that's mm -hmm. been around since 1945. It's mm -hmm. up in the Hamas Mountains. Uh, it's in full swing right now. Okay. So they have uh, about 400, they'll have about 450 kids up there from about five up to 17 mm -hmm. uh, and they do absolutely everything up there from climbing walls to hiking uh, archery uh, all kinds of team building programs and so forth and the kids come back year after year yeah so there's uh, they they actually come back in a in a learning track so mm -hmm. they go through a counselor and training program and they stay for years, but That's it's fantastic. just beautiful, beautiful camp. That's great. Okay, and then of course also, let's talk about some of the youth and government programs mm -hmm. that you guys offer. The youth and government program is probably one of the uh, one of the best in the United States, mm -hmm. right here in New Mexico. Um, we've got about 125 students from all over the uh, the, the state, mm -hmm. and they will convene. They go through a, a learning process. They do. Uh, elections um, they get up into the le during the legislative session we actually have a Y day at the Capitol really okay. and um, they learn all about our government uh, following the session they have actually written bills and they literally take over the roundhouse after no the kidding. session wow. um, they are actually right now at a conference uh, back in North Carolina to come with come together with other youths and they will debate the bills and so forth. So no it's kidding. just an incredible, incredible uh, program. Yeah, yeah, lots of stuff going on. All right, so last question, of course, sure. locations. We want to yes. get involved with the YMCA. Where do we okay. go? Okay, There are uh, two large locations there on Indian School, the Horn location, mm -hmm. right there between Carlisle and San Mateo. Okay. And then there's another location uh, up there uh, Comanche, almost near Tramway. Okay. And then we've got after-school programs all over, uh, all over um, Albuquerque and in Rio Rancho. We also have a daycare up in Santa Fe. Okay. And a couple of after-school locations there. So Fantastic. We're all over. You are, and and a daycare down downtown too. That's great. So. Well, Zizi, thank you so much thank for everything you. that you do. Thank Again, guys, you. for more information on how you can get involved with the YMCA of New Mexico, head over to casa.com.